All right, welcome back to Suica, everyone. I haven't played this in a long time. Uh, here's an update on Suica-related things, though. So, I, I mentioned on the first time I played this, I was like... I trained for this by playing, like, the monkey version on the mobile that was on, like, the App Store. And recently, I was just, like, lying in bed, and I was like... I didn't really watch, want to watch videos. I usually watch videos before I go to sleep. But I've been watching a lot of videos that day, and I was like, I'm just gonna, like, play a game or something. What do I have on my phone? And actually, first, I played 2048. Because I never beat that. I said I never beat that game. I played it for, like, a little bit, and then I finally beat it for the first time. And it, it didn't even seem that hard. I feel like I carried over skills from this game, where you're trying to, like, combine the stuff. You're trying to place things in a way that they always end up combinable still, and you don't get, like, scrap in the way. I feel like it's very similar to that. So, I finally got- I finally beat that game. And then I'm like, well, I have no reason to ever play that again. So I came back to that monkey version on the mobile store. And then I got double watermelon in that game. Which is a lot easier because there's more space, but still. It was still really satisfying. And I was like, well, now there's only one thing left to do. Which is get double watermelon in the actual game. Which is like 50 times harder. But I did have that one attempt that was like very possible. So that's that's my update with Suica related things. That's why I've decided to play it again. I don't know if it'll stick around, we'll see. But I'm down to play it today. It is that's that's like one of my gamer bingo cards is, uh, or bingo goals or whatever, just as a whole, is get double watermelon in this game. Because, like, nobody ever does that. So many people play this and never get it. Because it's friggin' impossible. And it's probably irrelevant now, you know, everyone, it was like a big thing for a while. Nobody plays this anymore, whatever. We play irrelevant games all the time. <laughs> I'm not a trend chaser. I just play what I want. But yeah, if you haven't seen this, you basically... It's a very simple puzzle game. You just get the two same fruits to touch, and then they become a bigger fruit. And then you want to make the watermelon. And the impossible achievable goal is double watermelon, which then disappears. But they're so big that they take up, like, the entire... Your entire space, so you can't have, like, any scrap. Yeet! You have to make the balls touch. Yeah, Suica game's a little gay. In that regard. This is not a good start, but it's okay. If those peaches ever touch, that would help. There we go. Nice. You came back to speak a game as gay. I don't know, that seems like a pretty normal thing to come back to.
Don't ascend out of the space, please, Orange. I see you trying to leave. There is so much scrap, but we can maybe make watermelon still. Um, uh oh, that, I didn't mean to drop that in there. Physics? Go over there! Yes! <laughs> Go! Go to the left! No, dude! The orange is in the way. I think it's over. Unless I somehow, like, get rid of some of this stuff. Nah. Yo, <laughs> you see it go down? Oh shit, none of you thought that was happening. <laughs> Nobody thought that would happen. I may have instantly lost, but at least I got the single watermelon. We should do some predictions. Damn it! <laughs> Didn't you hear me type that I was doing it? <laughs> I clicked it and it was like... There was already a prediction, and then the actual prediction showed up. I, I put all... I did the whole thing and then I press enter and it didn't let me... Didn't let me do it. It's fine, I probably would have forgot to close it. <laughs> no, that's fine. I'm not really sure what the start is. Being a bit dumb. But it usually works out. You know, we learn from, as you learn from speedruns, speedrunning this game, uh, a lot of the times it doesn't really matter what you do at the start. It just like magically works out. It is nice to try and think about it though. I think it, I think it helps to play a bit slow and actually think a little bit. Because even just a little bit of scrap can like ruin your run if you're going for double. Hoping that would roll. Whoa, that was nice. I don't like what's going on in the middle, but I just made it worse.
That was kind of exciting. <laughs> I, yeah, just let everything happen, that's fine. No, you saw my plan, it didn't work. Logic is holding me back. Yeah, just randomly drop stuff. I don't know if I want that apple down there, I'll be honest. That wasn't really... Because <laughs> that's just going to be stuck. That was kind of a bad thing that happened. Disguised as a good thing. What is this tower on the left? This isn't good. No. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I guess that helps. Anyways, I was supposed to be up this in the Discord, but can I take a moment to uh, educate everyone about the biggest scam of all time in Unity? Apart from what they tried to pull with the. Uh, install costs, but like actually in the editor itself. So there's a thing that's called wait for seconds, right? And what you can do is you can make like a thread that basically it'll run something for a certain amount of seconds. And that's what the that's what it's called. It's called wait for seconds. And what I always thought is that that would wait for a second regardless, like, it would be consistent, a consistent wait, uh, regardless of what your frame rate is. But what actually happens is it's a consistent, like, I don't know, it, if your frame rate is higher, wait for seconds will wait less less time than it will wait if you have a lower frame rate. That You see how close that was to a watermelon chat? Believers got scammed. Believers actually got scammed. The two pineapples are right next to each other and they could have combined and like became the pineapple or the watermelon. That's actually, that's not even my fault, that's the game. <laughs> but yeah, um... Wait for seconds to scam. And I use it for everything. So basically everything in the whole game was FPS dependent. Everything that wasn't, you know... Like there, there were some things that weren't using wait for seconds, but a lot of stuff was. Like my rolls were, my attacks, boss waits, cutscene waits. So basically, everything was affected by FPS. If you played at like 30 FPS, everything would happen faster. Or wait, no, it would happen slower. But if, you, if the roll was slower, 
you would end up rolling longer because it would wait a longer time before removing the roll. Kind of thing. And yeah, I'm talking about Lost Call. But I, I found a way to fix it. You just have to, um, instead of wait for seconds, you do wait for fixed update, which will wait for the physics frame update, which is adjusted to whatever the uh, frame rate is. And you basically just put a while loop and you're like, while uh, a timer is like below a certain number, then you, uh, you like increase it and you wait for a physics frame. And you can still do it in coroutines, you just can't use wait for seconds because it's a scan. And probably nobody knows what I'm talking about unless you're a dev, but... <laughs> Yeah, I have to I have to change a lot of shit now. I guess a lot of it doesn't really matter. I'm probably gonna leave some of it in. I think the most important stuff is like I'm gonna make sure the bosses attacks are like it, it's it's at the end of the day it's a small difference, right? You won't really notice it a whole lot unless you're switching from like 200 FPS to like 30. But for fake. For things like rolls, and you want the roll distance to be consistent, to me that's really important. And it's kind of funny because when I was trying to figure out how to fix it, there were literally people on like the forums saying, you don't need it to be that precise. What could you possibly need to be pre that precise? You can just use wait for seconds. I'm like, these people are stupid, dude, what do you mean? You don't want your shit to be precise? You don't want your character to roll the same distance every time? That's insane to me. That's crazy to me that anyone would think that. I was like getting so pissed reading that comment from someone. Because <laughs> meanwhile, I'm trying to figure out how to fix it. And there's this person in the forum like, why would you ever need to be that precise? And I'm like, do you play video games? Obviously you want everything to be exact in a video game or else it becomes this like frame rate dependent bullshit. That always sucks. This is bad by the way. Can these touch? Those will never touch. Oh! Those will never touch though. Oh! It's going down! <laughs> Maybe not. Oof, I don't know what's happening here. Nothing good. I can make a melon here, probably. If I play this right. Please, go over there. Melon! Sadly, this might be where it all ends. I don't think I can make another melon unless something dramatically changes here. Why is the, the entire world is shifting right now? Maybe something will happen. But probably not. It's okay, we gotta learn how to work with very little space. Because that's how you ha what you have to do when you have a double watermelon attempt.
Look at that. Clutch. Yo, the the bounce. Uh, this is bad. No, <laughs> that could have worked out if that orange didn't. Yeet. I play Minecraft. Nope. I have Minecraft. I even, they had to, I had to like switch my account because they're like, you're going to get locked out of Minecraft if you don't switch your account. And then I did and I still never played it. I mean, I streamed it twice. Because my plan was I was going to beat the Ender Dragon for the first time. And then I gave up because I lost all my iron armor in the nether. <laughs> And all the iron surrounding my base was already stripped. So I couldn't even make new armor. There was scurry craft though. That was a thing briefly. Hello everyone and welcome to episode one of Scurry Craft. Series where I play Minecraft. Okay, bye, daylight. Try and build up the left side more here. I don't know why I did that. That was like the biggest throw of all time. There was no reason to put those grapes there. Okay, might be able to salvage that. Get that in there. Nice. Ah, oh, Strab, why? You've ruined me. Strawberries, please. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. No. I don't play multiplayer. I just did a Super Animal Royale stream. Unless you're talking about multiplayer Minecraft. I mean, I've like thought about doing it before, I don't know. It just takes more setup because like someone has to have a server. Like other games are easier because you can just join up with your friends instantly. You don't have to have someone who owns a server or whatever. Hmm, I don't like this. Whoa. Okay, they, they managed to touch somehow.
You can make this work. No, I threw. Whoa, <laughs> that worked really well, actually. Is it a mod that makes it easier? I don't know, I just, I'm not like super into Minecraft anyways. I feel like there's not a whole lot to do in that game. That I would want to do, really. I just want to beat the Ender Dragon and then I'd probably be happy. But I guess that could be fun to do that co-op. Melon. I need to get rid of this crap over here. Please? I don't like that grapes. It's already causing problems. See the flick there? <laughs> I think that I think that strawberry is fine. I don't think it's gonna do anything. I think we'll be okay. Please. It did. It actually messed me up. No way. Wait, wait, oh my god, I did nothing and it was no strat. I did literally nothing and it just shifted. It's not the best attempt for a double. Cause stuff are kinda, stuff is kinda everywhere. Do my best though. Uh, this sucks. There's no space to even put things through this. Damn. Damn it, dude. Awful. So much stuff I can't even get to now. Okay, we're shifting it. We're shifting it. That's good. That's what you want. Risk this. Nice. Lucky. Oh, that was kind of clutch. It didn't really work out how I wanted it, though. Strawberry, don't come back. No. No, dude, I dropped that by accident. 
No. <laughs> Can I make this work, please? Oh, that hurts. That hurts. Damn. It's not giving me so much oranges. I think it's over. Nowhere to put this either. Dude, <laughs> the stacks. Wow, I got so many pears, dude. What? No, the apple! That might have worked if it wasn't for the apple. I gotta not put apples up there. But the thing is... The thing is, is that the reason I put the apple there is because if I didn't put the apple there, I would have been building up, covering everything on the left anyways. So I think it was just kind of a situation where it's like, you're just screwed, right? Bad RNG, bad positioning. I don't know. I don't. I didn't want to put an apple up there, but I didn't see any other option. So I don't know. It's tough. Yeah, I'm playing the Switch version. The Switch version is the only one that looks like this, as far as I know. Unless there's like clones that try to. Mimic it. Or did they- is there like an official mobile port now? There wasn't when I first played this. Those don't touch? Okay. Five apples on screen. <laughs> We're not just doing watermelon predictions anymore. Well, anything like that is pretty random. I'm not going to specifically go for anything like that. Those aren't going to touch. Maybe someday. Never mind. Ruin that chance. scrap going on. No, what was that? Nice. Two apples. <laughs> we actually, we don't want a lot of apples on the screen at once. In most scenarios. Just bought this game. 
you may get addicted for a while. Warning. There's also, I didn't know about this, you can go to overall ranking and it'll show you what your place is of like out of every single game you've played. You can see this is currently the 244th best attempt. It's apparently still the 244th best attempt. Oh, 243. I should leave it on that just because that's that's fun to look at. No, why that roll that way? <laughs> there were three apples. <laughs> they are now gone, though. There is none. Squish. Wow, these are rotating like crazy. Please, something. Stop giving me these. This, uh, okay. I'm struggling. Let's give me another orange. Yes. No. Damn. I don't know about these two melons, chat. Oh my god! Oh my god! Go in! Go in! Please! <gasps> no way! <laughs> Let's go! Problem is, this is a complete mess. Wait! Wait! Oh! <gasps> No, why did it combine like that? Whatever. Pineapple and melon hanging out. Maybe get 3k, I don't know about <laughs> better than that. Dude, this orange, why would you go in? Why would you go in there? Cool cherries. Quad cherries. What? This sucks. 
Why are you giving me so much oranges? I can't do anything with these. It's over. I'm get. This is not the time I want 50 billion oranges. There are times where I want that much oranges, but not this time. This is my 28th best run, though. And now it ends. Top 30. <laughs> Just unfortunate things happening. I'm doing pretty well with melons, watermelons though. Lots of watermelons. That's good. Consistency. That's what you need. Just get as many attempts past single watermelon you can do. It's like, it's like speed running. You gotta get as many runs out of early game as you can. And then throw them all to... QGA. Oh, by the way, chat. Uh, we may be doing some speedrunning stuff this week. A little bit of speedrunning stuff. On, on an old game that I, uh... <laughs> I, I used to run for a little bit. To practice for something. I'm, I'm being vague. I'm trying to be vague. It's not Hollow Knight. No, what is happening? This is like a horrible start. But you gotta keep running, even when you get the bad splits in early game. Speedrunning train this train me for this. This is so awkward, though. Those are going to roll to the wrong side, too. Come on, dude. Just go in there. Just getting a bunch of cherries. A bunch of stuff I don't want. This is a horrible start. May as well just spam to get this. Never mind, no consistency anymore. It's all gone. I'll try to save this, but it looks impossible. Shit. Why is everyone freaking out? Four apples? Was it that again? <laughs> Was that the prediction again? I only got four apples because it's the worst run of all time. Oh, it was three peaches. Same thing. Oh! Oh! Salvaging it? Oh, 
I knew that wasn't going to work and I still tried. I don't know why. I'm just desperate after this start for something to work. Is my music done? Dude, why does YouTube do this? It's like, oh, you're listening to music? We're gonna pause it because you're tapped out. Just play the music. I probably need to download the like YouTube music app to not do that. Of course I'm tapped out, it's music. Oh, well, we got a melon out of this, somehow. Whoa! <laughs> that single cherry yeeted the entire melon across the map. Strong cherry. Wow. Magic? Miracles do happen? Everything's split up though. Like, I'm not even sure what to do. I guess I'm just building up on the right side. And the left side. Come on, Peach. No. <laughs> this is so silly. What the hell is physics? Push? This is stupid. <laughs> this is dumb. Definitely not happening. Alright, that attempt sucked. That attempt was really bad. Just get that one over with. I'm honestly surprised I even got Mel in that attempt. It could have worked out, that's why I kept going. Like somehow, like sometimes it just like explodes and it like gets put through the blender and magically works out. Don't like that grapes. No. Dude, you blocked me.
Stop pushing things. Okay. Once again, I don't know why I tried it. This should work out though, right? Like, come on. It's because there's like all these things in the right here. <laughs> I'm just going to do this. I don't know why. Just have a feeling. Whoa. Magic? That was actually just a complete misplacement by accident. <laughs> what is happening? Yeet. Definitely not getting down to that pair. So I'm just gonna make a new one. What the hell? We're making all sorts of pairs. Whoa! <laughs> that was pretty lucky. Only these two could touch. That'd be pretty great. Music going off. This is the Feather OST. Watch my playthrough of that too. You want another chill stream? That sucks. That really does suck, doesn't it? See, and now at what cost, right? Like, I got it now, but now there's stuff in the middle. crazy shit happening on the right. Imagine I combine these somehow. I'm so bad. No, I thought I could do it in time. Rip. That would have changed everything if I got that play. It's like completely screwed now. Oh well, this is a rip. I saw like the potential to combine, drop things down the right and have like an explosion that resulted in the two peaches touching at the bottom left, but I went for the play, I missed it. It's over. What? It doesn't even let me try. Worst attempt yet. Probably, I don't know.
financial decision. This isn't real money. It feels real. That's fair. You, sometimes you spend like months getting all your channel points and then you spend it all on one thing. And it's all gone. <laughs> Even if it's not real money, it it still hurts. Damn it, dude. I'm just I'm just making bad drops. Like I'm doing stuff. I'm trying to make things happen and I just I dropped it in the wrong spot. And you can't be making misplays like that. When you're going for double wadis. <laughs> It's a very intense. You got. You got to be focused. You got to not make any mistakes. Constantly be thinking about your next move. Or I don't know. Just like spam A and hope it works. Double Wadis. <laughs> that's that's what the Suica community calls it, right? Double Wadis. No! How am I gonna get double Wadis when that happens? Those will never touch in any universe. I'm just gonna build in between. Has to be done. Whoa, that was a combo. That I definitely had planned out the whole time. That's just the kind of plays you need to get double wadis. Frick! Cherry! Can something touch here? Thank you. Six drops. <laughs> Are we still doing counting fruit <laughs> predictions? How much drops do we need? Team Cherry is here, everyone. Look at all the cherries. Nice. That was some magic physics. Try and get rid of these. No, the bounce! Okay, that's fine. That actually worked out perfectly. No apples, dude. They're not touching. There's an apple in every corner. We'll get him. No, no, what is this shit? That grapes is gonna ruin the whole run now. No way.
Actually, this might be doable. Not anymore. <laughs> Continental shift. Just make a third one, maybe? No, oh, I'm dumb. Ready for this chat? When I press A, I don't lose and I get a watermelon. No! <laughs> I was half right! <laughs> Dude, the music. Do you hear like the strings picking up? As they were about to touch, that was like beautiful. That was a magical moment. Was that a watermelon prediction? Oh, believers, I got you. <laughs> it was like, duh, as they're like slowly going together. <laughs> amazing. What am I even doing here? I didn't mean to do that. What side am I building up on? I guess this side. Love wins. Oh, the clean board. Love to see it. It's no longer clean, <laughs> so I just got a bunch of crap. Okay. Still clean. Why is the Will Smith copy faster here? Release Silk Song tomorrow because you got the watermelon. No, I gotta get double watermelon and then Silk Song comes out. You know what we're really waiting for though? You know what everyone's really waiting for to come out? Lost Call Demo 2. Coming out soon. That's the real shit. It's almost ready. <laughs> I just... I gotta fix the fact that everything was frame rate dependent. And I never knew the whole time. And like a couple other things. I have, I have like a sticky note of everything I have to do and it's it all fits on one sticky note, but I'm probably gonna find more things. Yo? Yo, they rolled on wheels. Pineapples on wheels.
Uh, okay. Yeah, see, that's the thing. I, I have played a lot of games. Speed games that have frame rate dependent stuff. But it always sucks. I hate frame rate dependent shit. So much. It's like the worst. You want it to not have stuff like that. Because then, like, you have to have a good enough PC, or you have to intentionally lower your performance to do certain things, and it's, like, annoying. So I want to, like, avoid stuff like that. But it does happen a lot. A lot of people leave that in their games. But I have, like, a personal vendetta against that stuff, so... I'm doing my best not to. Long rolls were... Yeah, they were. No, I confirmed that. That's why I'm talking about this, is because uh, I fixed it. I was playing around with frame rate stuff. And uh, I was in-game capping it to 30 FPS, and uh, <laughs> long rolls were the easiest thing ever. Because I usually play uncapped. And I was always like, how do people do these? That apple is escaping me. No, dude! Grapes! Oh, grapes. We need to get rid of those grapes. Does it really matter, though? Because this these aren't going to touch anyways. Because now there's another grapes! <laughs> it's always grapes. Why they bounce like that? This is the bounciest grapes of all time. Ugh. Come on. Why did I put it there? No, what if I I'm throwing? I give up next run. Yeah, it, dude, it looks so bad at 30 FPS. It's weird, right? I feel like I've played games at 30 FPS. I have. It's called Switch games. But, like, it looks so bad for Lost Call because I always play it at, like, Probably it's several hundred. It looks so smooth. But like switching it to 30, it looks so bad. It's like the most notice noticeable thing in the universe to me. But that's kind of like Hollow Knight too. When I cap it to 50, for stall balls, it's like, it looks so jittery. Although with Hollow Knight, I have accidentally left it on, so that means it doesn't look too bad. Whale game? Yeah, you two can play. I'm I'm trying to get double bodies. <laughs> Maybe I'll play that again sometime.
I haven't watched an anime in like years, honestly. I have watched a decent amount though. Get in there. gaming is very important to do to try and get it'll be the highlight of my gaming career if I ever get it this is a good start please what the hell dude I was trying to drop the oranges together I don't even know how that happened certain order it might still work out there this melon's on wheels I'm gonna bump this. Okay, I. That's not what I was going for. It's okay though. No, that's the last thing I ever wanted to happen there. What is this trifecta of orange? This is so dumb. Oh my god. Oh wait, it's kind of working. Just get this apple. Just get rid of this apple, please. No, what is this? What is happening? We're making a pattern. This is awful. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going to get single with this run. Nope. Keeps getting worse. Okay, just end that one. That one was horrible. Awful. <laughs> it's sweet again. Good OST. It's already become like one of my <laughs> frequent songs I put on, or just OSTs I put on. It's the Feather OST.
More specific gambles. What is this one? Four cherries touching the bottom. <laughs> These are silly. No cherries touching the bottom. None. Get wrecked. Here's one. It's not touching, though. Not looking good for the believers here. <laughs> no, I misplaced that. I screen warped. I'm trying really hard to get a strawberry in here, but it's not going to work. And now it's there. The strawberry ramp strats? 100% intentional. The grape ramp? That was insane. That was actually crazy. <laughs> that was actually insane. It was all planned, obviously. One cherry touching the bottom, everyone. Oh, rip. You had it for a sec. You had one for a little bit. <laughs> that one's not doing it either. No, what? Not even. Don't even have any cherries in the whole game. How about that? Oh, the apple combo. Damn, I need to get rid of that. Oh, that sucks. I knew something. I knew that was going to happen, but like there was nothing I could do. I can get rid of it now. Yes, thank you, grapes. That might be a bit tricky to get rid of, though, the orange. Two of these. Get in there. Push it down! Push it down, yes! Wait for it to uh, settle here. My current problem is grapes, as usual. There we go. No! I misclicked. It's fine. It worked out perfectly, actually. <laughs> this is like textbook gaming right now. This is what you want to happen. It's a little bit of scrap, but it's okay. No. No! Starting to throw a little bit here. 
Get in there, please. Orange, don't mess this up for me. Nice. Nice. We got so much space. Alright, this is our best attempt today. We gotta focus now. This is by far my best attempt. Gotta get rid of that down there. Yes, the roll! Yes. This cherry has nowhere to go though. RNG, nice. My like heart rate is increasing. <laughs> I'm not even that far in. It's just actually a good attempt, which never happens. JX, thanks for the two years. Damn you, cherries. That's bad. Please get rid of that. Thank you. Oh my. No, if they touched, if the apples 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 touched, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. <laughs> you have no idea if the apples touched, it was it. If the apples touched, I would have got double watermelon. <laughs> Why do I have a strawberry? It's gonna block the two apples. No, <laughs> you can't be making mistakes like that. No! <laughs> uh, I'm throwing, I'm throwing. <laughs> Everyone's getting like secondhand stress from this. You know what it's time for. Oh, you know I got it. <laughs> Cause of the zoom. Real run attempt alert chat. 
Now, here's an unfortunate thing. Last time I got in this scenario, my melon went above the melon, the watermelon, and I had so much more space to work with. We do not have a whole lot of space to work with. There's not much space. Because it's like stacked awkwardly. That could work out very well for me. Okay, no. No. Yes, stay over there. Perfect. Oh, okay. This is crazy. <laughs> oh, no. Every decision I'm like, I'm actually like so stressed about. <sighs> like here, here's my thought process here. I, I've come to a roadblock. I feel like I need to focus on the right. I'm worried if I place it on the right, it's not going to give me another tangerine. I think I just need to go for it. I think I just need to go over here. Tangerine, thank you. That was a panic placement because I really wanted to get that in time. And that's kind of rough actually. <sighs> Almost yeeted it. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Stop my music again. <laughs> I'm so scared, you have no idea. Where do I put this cherry, dude? <laughs> Where do I put this cherry? What is this cherry doing here? <laughs> I, need to, I need a break, I need a break. I need to breathe. You don't you don't get opportunities like this very often. Oh my god, I bumped my controller. I almost just pressed it. Whew. Okay. I'm thinking right side. I don't know. It could become a problem, but I don't think there's a better choice. Where's my music, bro? Is it playing? I need it to keep me calm.
Uh oh. No! No! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. That was such a good attempt. That was such a good attempt, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was actually insane. Okay. See, it's doable, chat. It is doable. I did not expect to even have a anything close to that good of a run today. It's so doable. I've like unlocked another freaking level of gaming for these kinds of games. I don't know what happened. I really don't know what happened. That was just that was just RNG at that point. It's there's not much I can do. I play, I think I played it right, and it just kind of happened. Sometimes they eat. Sometimes you just get the wrong items. But I think I played that amazingly. I think I was like actually popping off. Whew. See, this game gets intense. This game actually does get intense when it's like you have a run like that. Look at that, we got a 3, 4, 9, 8. Now I have two runs that are almost... that were almost, uh... double whiny. Just gotta get more attempts like that. I need to, like, come back down to Earth, though, because I'm still, like, shaking. <laughs> I knew, chat, you could tell I knew it was, like, an attempt. Pretty early on, like I can tell when it's a good attempt. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but like... There's just times where you get the single watermelon, and you know it's not really gonna happen because there's too much stuff everywhere. I'm glad I have that whole run on stream, so I can like look back at that if I want to. Last time I got that, it was off stream, and I only recorded like the last 30 seconds or whatever. So I can actually like look back on that. And I got to do it on stream, which just makes me feel cool. We It, it could have happened. Dude, I don't know what happened. I, I beat 2048. I beat the monkey mobile version. I've just become trained to be good at this, apparently. Just gotta play a bunch of games similar to it. What is the monkey mobile one called? It's like some weird name. It's not even close to Suica game. But you can probably find out what I'm talking about. Okay, we're building a pattern. You don't want to see patterns like that. Oh! It just needs a little nudge. Just needs two little nudges.
To be honest, I'm not even really like upset that I lost that because the fact that I even got it that close makes me happy. Because I was like, I was wondering like, how long is it going to take to have another real attempt at double watermelon? Because it's like, it feels so rare. And honestly, that didn't take that long because I played this like once off stream since the stream anniversary. And then there was today, so. It's pretty fast. How do I get good at Hollow Knight? Uh, play it for 2,000 hours, do like speed runs. Do all bindings, pantheons, I don't know. <laughs> That's all the stuff I did. And now I just like do randos and it's like easy because it's nothing compared to that. Or meme speed runs. Although I haven't done a meme speed run in a while, I just haven't had ideas. I almost bunked out of the corner. It, it felt like I was going to fall out of the mat. Go down. Don't even know I really want that to go down because it's kind of in a bad spot. Yeet the tangerine. Ah. No. <laughs> that was such. That would have been such a play if I placed that in there to block the apple. I thought of it like just too late. Get in there. Get in there times two. Get in there times five. It worked. What? Okay, that's fine. Do you imagine two back-to-back -back double wadi attempts? Because honestly, this isn't looking that bad right now. Ah! What is happening over here? I had to jinx it. Main problem I'm having here is this is not going to it's not going to fit now. Damn. I should have focused more to one side. Wait, it's kind of uh, shifting. Oh my. The scraps in the worst spot ever. I'm surprised I didn't just lose it for me. No, orange, please. Yes.
Really? <laughs> Tangerine, why? I wonder if I could have, like, pressed A to cancel that from eating. I had the thought, but it, like, happened too fast. What was the prediction? What fruit kills the run? <coughs> it was Tanj. The Tanj. Oh, I ran out of- I actually ran out of music this time. Um... I got an idea. Whoops, I still have the Gorman's crafting chart open. This makes me want to play this more, because I had another good attempt. That's what motivates me to play this. Is the elusive double watermelon. I don't care about anything else. For a while it just felt impossible, but... It's starting to feel less impossible. I don't know if I was just lucky. There are, like, there's people who can get it fairly consistently. So there, there is like, there's a certain amount of skill that goes into it for sure. There's definitely luck as well, but I think like just getting it once, there's no way luck is going to completely prevent you from getting it. Hoping that other one would transform. Oh, okay, I'm just kind of throwing. After having a speech on how this game is skill based, I'm just being bad. Time is it? 7.30. I stream pretty, uh... I stream, like, early afternoon. But that's because that's when I wake up. Like, I wake up and then I stream. I wake up at, like, 1.30. Or later, <laughs> like, recently. <laughs> like, 2. No, why would you do that? Wow, that was an unexpected result. The orange got away!
Anyone, anyone know the OST? That's playing? Not that one, that's Wobble Dogs. Yep, it's Lottle Nuts. I'm gonna make a Lottle Nuts video uh, as my next one. Because I love that game. I love making the videos of the games I really enjoyed playing. Because then I get to like re experience the game through editing it. And then, you know, I can just have Zord do all the Hollow Knight and stuff. <laughs> it's not looking good. This is a bit of a mess. This is a lot of a mess. I, uh, whatever. Go to the next one. Yeah, the only problem with Waddle Knot is it's a bit short. I even I went back and I uh I hundred percent at it, which really didn't take long. You just have to I was missing two hollow badges. And then you have to get Every, every zone needs to be full with Lottles, including the home zone. So I just took a bunch of Lottles from <laughs> the other zones and just put them in the home until they laid enough eggs everywhere else. It didn't even take that long. And then I took a picture of Gini and made it my profile. <laughs> That's when I did that. I was just, I don't know, I wanted to change my PFP, but I didn't, I wasn't sure what to to change it to. And I just happened to be playing that, so I'm like, that's a good idea. I usually just make it some Pokemon I like, or some character from something I'm playing or watching. But I guess I haven't really been uh, like watching much stuff. I should get into a new series, maybe. I've been watch. I guess I've been watching just like YouTube mostly. Been, I watched like I'm pretty sure I watched the pilot of both the Vizzy Pop Vizzy Pop shows, and I wasn't really super into them. I mean, it is just like a pilot, but I really like the characters. Like the character designs are so cool, but I just wasn't really getting into the actual show really. I got a lot more into Digital Circus. I thought that was actually like really interesting to me. Damn. I tried to stop that even. Combo? Keep going. 
Keep going, no, strawberry. Strawberry. Roll the roll strats. Bump, nice. <laughs> you can see there's some strategies you can do. If you know how the physics work. And now I'm screwed, probably. Yo! I panic dropped that. <laughs> I don't know if that was like gonna prevent anything from happening, but I have heard I've heard that like it apparently sucks to animate those shows because of how over designed the characters are. But I gotta be honest, I think they're they look awesome. I've seen people meme about like how over designed they are, but like who cares? If they look cool. It's a cool design, that's all I, that's what I think. I mean, I don't have to animate that shit, but... <laughs> Just in general. Damn, okay, this actually might be doable? Wow. I just need to eat this. Eat it! Oh, it's not going to be enough, because <laughs> now I have to make another one. <laughs> yeah, that's not happening. Really? <laughs> I thought that would let me. The imps, which the girls are allowed to look as crazy as the dudes. Yeah, that's fair. I can see that. Like just coming, just thinking of the ones that I can, that come to mind, like the female characters are pretty similar. But I don't know, I haven't seen like every character, I don't think. <laughs> the, the prediction handler left I think. <laughs> yeah, there's definitely the thing where, you know, I'm not saying it's in that show, but just the general thing where it's like, oh, the female character has to look like the, uh, like a typical <laughs> attractive human female, and then the Male characters can just look like creatures. I mean, there was uh, a lot of people were calling that out in uh, Fists, Forge and Shadow Torch, which is completely fair. <laughs> because it was that that's like it was super true.
But you know, I wasn't gonna shit on that. I was sponsored. <laughs> I can't be talking shit. The game was good. I I do believe the game was good. I wouldn't have played it if it didn't look cool and if it wasn't actually fun. So, you know, I'm not gonna like completely discount the game because it does the Smurfette thing. But or is that what it's called? I don't know. That might be a different thing. I think the Smurfette thing is when there's one female character in the whole in the cast, and they're like the typical female character. That always is acts super feminine and stuff. I'm honestly, I don't regret any of the sponsors I've taken because they were all good games. And I vet that stuff so that I'm not sponsoring like shit games. Because I think that, you know, I don't want to be talking about like something that is cool and it's like I don't even like it. I don't need the money that bad. <laughs> even the wallet sponsor I did way back, I still use that wallet. It's still good. It's lasted me years. And it's actually a cool wallet. So I have no regrets. No, it's it's X Exter, I think. I think I said it wrong in the ad and they didn't care. I literally sent them the ad to like proof watch it. And they said it was okay. I think I said the name wrong. But they didn't say anything. So I didn't even know until later. I don't know, Ridge always looked unimpressive to me. It just looks like a slab that you like, I don't know. The extra wallet has like this thing where you, you press the button down and all your cards come out in like this nice evenly spaced out way and you can just grab them. It's like actually so good. And this is not an ad, <laughs> but it's actually awesome. It is expensive as hell, but at least it's cool and useful. Damn, I was hoping that would push that down. Oh, that works. Yeah, I mean, when when did I do that sponsor? I don't know. I've had it since then. Still using it. And it's still super nice to just press the button and then I can grab whatever card I want instantly. I feel so cool doing that when I take out my debit card because I'm like... Everyone else is like trying to pull it out and all this stuff. <laughs> they gotta do actual work, I can just press the button. I feel like I'm doing an ad, dude. I'm gonna stop talking about it. <laughs> oh, that was lucky. Come on, these can touch, I believe. I believe, somehow, some way. <gasps> Come on, dude. Touch. Their love is forbidden, please. No, no, don't separate them further. I want them to love each other! 
What a tragedy. What an actual Shakespearean tragedy that was. Am I a lemon? Lemon. There's no lemons in this. If you were a fruit, what fruit would you be? I don't know what I'd pick. What What do you think, chat? What is, is there a fruit that I'm I am like? That I remind you of. Fly Sky things for the 26. RNG beam. Honestly, I'm fine to just chill. If I get another good attempt going, that's okay, but I already had a good attempt. I'm satisfied. That was. <laughs> that was the most exciting thing that's happened to me in months. The previous thing, of course, being the last time I had that attempt, an attempt going. Dragon fruit. Oh my gosh. Yes. They love each other. I may have not never had the uh, the other peaches touched, but those ones did. Peach. <laughs> yeah, if, if dragon fruit is a cheater answer, because it's like, you know, you're a dragon, so dragon fruit, obviously. It's, it's kind of cheating, because you, you don't put any more thought into it. <clears throat> At the same time, though, I've been asked, like, what would your Pokemon typing be? And I just say Water Dragon, so... <laughs> but that, that'd be true anyways, I feel. Especially water, because I always love the water starters in the water Pokemon. Like, half of my top 10 Pokemon are water types, probably. I love water types. I'd be a water bender as well, if we're talking the avatar stuff. I just like water in general. And it's funny because I'm like, in all those signs and whatever, which I don't really believe mean anything anyways. I'm always water as well. There's like the, uh, there's Aquarius. I'm Aquarius and whatever that is. And I remember checking at some point what my, uh, Chinese animal was like the year. And I thought, or, you know, I I'm not a dragon unfortunately, but I, I'm a rat, and I, there's apparently like an element thing, and the element was water. So it's just, it's always water. Aquarius is air type in what? <laughs> air type. There's, there's typings for that stuff. Touch. Touch purple. There is water in the air. 
And you know, you know the craziest thing? I'm actually made up of mostly water. As well. Yeet the apple, that almost lost it for me. Water starters are underappreciated, by the way. Past the first few gens. I feel like they're always left out. Even though they're always the coolest. When are they ever not the coolest? It's a good attempt so far. Swampert's your favorite of all time. I feel like Swamp... I, I guess, yeah, Swamp... Even Swampert is underappreciated. Like, there is a... I feel like the water types that do get appreciated a lot of the times, it's just because of their starter evolution. I feel like that's the case with Swampert. Please touch. You know what? We're doing a play here, we're just gonna keep going. Never mind. <laughs> I felt like that was gonna happen. But you can like intentionally keep them from touching and then have an explosion at the end. I actually saw like there's someone who did that. Like I saw a video of that. But I can never it's like that's a miracle to ever have happen, right? Like how would you ever intentionally do that? Oh, speaking of Mudkip, did anyone watch uh, Pokemon Concierge? That's something I did watch, actually, recently. That's the most recent thing I watched. I actually thought it was pretty good. There was, like, one episode that was, like, kind of weird, because it had, like, the mud... It had the, the Magikarp with the ring, and it was, like... We have to get the ring back, and then they just evolve and they don't need the ring anymore. And it was like weird. But the freaking Pikachu episode, like, literally made me cry. So. I'd say it was pretty good. And I love it. the art style is really cool. There's like. I don't want to spoil it, but there's like a shy Pikachu. And it's like so adorable. What the hell is this? May have messed up a bit here. May have wedged a grapes down there somewhere by accident. And now that's going to ruin it for me. Yep, knew it. That's kind of on me for that happening. Could have played that better. Might as well play this. Probably not gonna stream too much longer, it's already been five hours. I'll finish out this run at least. Even though it's probably not gonna end well.
Jeez, chill. No, Apple! One more, one more, one more. Last one. Scurry vibe. I was thinking about like trying to animate like some dance. If anyone can do a scurry dance animation, that'd be awesome. Because I don't know how to do that. <laughs> it could be really simple too. Because I do have like 50 animated emote slots. Some of which I'm planning on just replacing with normal emotes. But it would be cool to get some animated ones. There is, there's some that are in the Discord that I could add. As long as, like, everyone's fine with that, because I don't know if, like... It's kind of weird, because people just made those for free, and then I'm gonna be, uh... They're gonna be, like, available to pay to get, so I don't know. That's my only thing about that. If anyone, like, has made an animated emote and, like, is fine with it being added, then you can let me know. I don't know if I want to just take them all and like put them up for paid things. Like I was fine with doing that for follower emotes because that's free. But I like to ask permission if it's for a paid sub. Alright Kibble, if you could, if you want to make one, that'd be awesome. Because then it would look, it would match the style even. Yeah, it would be cool to get some new animated stuff. I just, you know, I can kind of fill in some of the emotes myself, but I'm... I I mean, you know, I, I animate for my game, but I feel like that's a bit different. I could do some, like, pixel art animation, like, really simple stuff. I can just add in Rem walking around as an emote. <laughs> Rem dying as an emote. I don't know. Like, those are animations. <laughs> uh, I just do it in Unity, so I like... I don't even use a software for animating. I just draw all the sprites and then play them in Unity, and if they look bad, then I change them. <laughs> so it's, it's not the best, but... I do really simple pixel animation, so it's like, it's fine for that. I have, there is an animator in Krita that I have played around with. And it seems pretty good. Like, I was able to mess around with it a bit. The peaches will never be together yet again. No, you just gotta push them. You just gotta push them. Push them! Yes, true love! That's really the important thing here. Like, getting double watermelon, getting single watermelon. <laughs> Who cares? The peach is touched. 
what happens? Oh my god, go in. Go in, you can do it. It looked like it might work for a second. The two pineapples. Unfortunately, love is still prevented. Wait. Wait. The two peaches! The two peaches! We must make them kiss. Make them kiss. No! Their love cannot be stopped. No. I don't think anything is happening this round. Go orange! Pineapples! <laughs> okay. We got melon. Alright chat. We had one crazy good run. I'm actually really happy I got that on stream because that was exciting. And that motivates me to keep trying. So I might stream this again sometime. But we'll be ending it here. Hope everyone had a good time. Clearly getting better? I don't know, maybe. I, I feel like I could do it at least. It feels doable, which to me is like, I feel like so many people played this while it was like exploding in popularity and I didn't hear about like anyone getting it. You know what I mean? That's why it's crazy to me. That's why it's so motivating to me to try and get it. It's because like, I don't know any streamer who got it. So it's like, it's something that so many people tried and didn't accomplish. So I don't know, it just makes me think it'd be really cool to get, even if it's no longer the popular thing to play anymore. It's like, whatever, it's still impressive if I do get it. Jello walk to out the stream. Meow, 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 meow. All right, everyone. Uh, we were playing Rain World earlier, so I'll throw you all over to uh, Ice if you want to watch some Rain World speed runs. Because I'm sure as heck not doing any. <laughs> I mean, maybe at some point I'll do some. All right, see you next time, everyone. Have a good rest of your day. Goodbye.